There are six stages to a slap shot. They are preparation, the wind up, the downswing, loading the stick, impact, and the follow through. The wind up. The player draws his stick back by raising his posterior arm and rotates both his trunk and hips to raise the blade of a stick as far behind and above him as possible. The more the muscles are stretched, the greater the force generated when they are contracted. The further the stick is drawn back, the greater the velocity of the shot. Finally, the weight is transferred from the front foot to the back foot. The downswing. The shooter rotates his hips, trunk, and shoulders, causing the stick to accelerate downward. Your aiming point should be the ice about four inches behind the puck. Loading the stick. As the stick comes in contact with the ice, the shooter continues to put pressure on the stick by pushing the lower hand against the shaft as the other hand holds the upper end of the stick close to the body. This causes the shaft to bend and store energy. Point of impact. As the shot continues, the blade strikes the puck, releases the energy, and accelerates the puck. For the best energy transfer, you want to strike the puck with the end of the blade closest to your body, also known as the heel of the blade. The follow through. After all the force is released on the puck, you finish your shot by following through and pointing your stick towards the target. All of the weight is placed on your front foot. And when you put all of the steps together, this is what it should look like. These are all the upper body muscles involved in taking a proper slap shot. These are all the lower body muscles involved in taking a proper slap shot. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed our video on the biomechanics of a slap shot.